Hell Knight, 1981. Here's the storyline. Four college pledges are forced to spend the night in a deserted old mansion where they get killed off one by one by the monstrous surviving member of a family massacre years earlier for trespassing on their living grounds. Directed by Tom DeSimone, written by Randy Feldman, released August 28, 1981. Tagline, Pray for Day. Here's the cast. Linda Blair as Marty Gaines. Vincent Van Patten as Seth, Peter Barton as Jeff Reed, Kevin Brophy as Peter Bennett, Jerry Newman as Mae West, Suki Goodwin as Denise Dunsmore, and Jimmy Sturvent as Scott. Now here is a good slasher slash teen movie. Linda Blair. Boy, Linda Blair. Love Linda Blair. It's funny how she became very, very popular for a simple movie of playing a possessed girl in The Exorcist. Great performance by her. Vince Van Patten, the son of Dick Van Patten, also a tennis player. You know, to me, this movie was ahead of its time in 81. I love this movie. I like the uh, mysterious, monstrous killer in his film. Basically, what's about is you have, you know, four college pledges are forced to spend a night in this deserted old mansion. But what they don't know, that the rumor and the myth is true, that there is a surviving member of the family that lived there before through a massacre. So, you have the 80s feel, you have the college kids thing, you have everything you want. And what I thought, again, was amazing was Linda Blair's performance in this one, whole way to the end. And a great ending, by the way. Fun film, great acting, great storyline. It's a classic of all time. It still holds up today. If you haven't seen it, it's Hell Knight, 1981, starring the lovely Linda Blair and Vincent Van Patten. Great cast of characters. Again, I saw this quite a few years ago, and uh, I rewatched it about uh, three months ago. So it still holds up. Damn good film. One of the classics from the 80s. This is Gruesome Herzog's. Harmony review. I give this film a 7.5 out of 10. I really enjoyed this. So if you haven't seen it, check it out. It's well worth a watch. This is Gruesome Herzog's Harmony review, and I'm out of here.